set. And they're off for the Judmont International Stakes. Master Craftsman got a bright start and is prominent early with George Bernard Shaw in the dark blue jacket. Set sail in the white cap is out wide and see the stars through the first furlong. He's quite happy to take the trail from the Aidan O'Brien trained trio. And they've gone off at a brisk early exchange, and it's George Bernard Shaw who forces the pace. Now tracked through by set sail. Master Craftsman follows his stable companions in third and a couple of lengths to see the stars given a waiting ride by Mick Kinnan, and he races with enthusiasm. Last of the quartet, the classic winner, tracking Master Craftsman and Johnny Murta. Go towards the end of three and a half furlongs, and on the sharp end, George Bernard Shaw by a length and a half from set sail. They establish themselves about four lengths clear of Master Craftsman and a couple of lengths to see the stars. Beginning the swing back towards home, approaching halfway in the Judmont International, George Bernard Shaw in set sail. Master Craftsman seeking to follow in the footsteps of Rodrigo de Triano, the last horse to successfully step up from a mile to win the Judmont International and see the stars still last, observing from last position under Mick Canan, who chases a third international success. Heads line up for home then. They quicken inside the last half mile, set sail, puts it up to George Bernard Shaw. Master Craftsman now easing onto the quarters of his stable companions and tracked all the time by See the Stars. And now Master Craftsman is to produce to lead. Two and a half furlongs to go. Kinnan waiting in the wings on See the Stars, who's still pulling double. Down past the two pole. murta has gone for the whip here on Master Craftsman. And See the Stars now shaken up, goes after the leader. They've quickened right away from the pacemakers. And now push has come to shove for See the Stars. Stars. What's the champion got left in the locker? Master Craftsman is galloping on strongly. Passes the furlong a length and a half clear. Now see the stars is out after him and begins to bear down on Master Craftsman. See the stars comes alongside Master Craftsman, eyeballs him and goes on. And it's four group ones and see the stars a galaxy apart wins the Judmont International. Master Craftsman in second, a long way clear of set sail and George Bernard Shaw. And four. They still can't do it. They cannot take See the Stars down. Moments of anxiety inside the final furlong as Master Craftsman responded generously to Johnny Murta's urgings. But Mick Kinnan was probably a good deal cooler than most of the See the Stars fans that are packing the grandstand on the Knavesmire this afternoon. Four straight Group 1s, Guineas, Derby, Eclipse, International, for a true champion of our time. See the Stars beats Master Craftsman in the International. Ding, ding. End of round four. Four cracks at See the Stars. Kulmer have had this uh, the most alarming for fans of the champion but he's got it done through guts and tenacity 